this, and I'm here to answer some of the questions that I've got from some of my viewers on YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook. Um, one of the biggest questions I get, and this is going to be the subject today, uh, what supplements do I take? What does my stack look like? And am I all natural? Um, yes, I'm definitely all natural. I'll answer that right now. Um, I've never taken any type of steroids or enhancers or human growth or anything like that. Um, I, it's just, as a personal trainer, I'm going to choose to stay away from that. Um, but uh, So as far as what I take supplement-wise, it uh, flips, but I'll go through what I'm on right now. So I take Carbogain. Uh, by now sports it's super uh, inexpensive you can get it for like 20 bucks for like a big five pound tub and the only reason I take carbo gain is because I have trouble eating uh, a lot of carbs and so I'll take carbo gain about two hours before my workout uh, with my BCAAs which brings me to my BCAAs I take a BCAA uh, um, I take it more or less for the endurance and energy um, I feel like it does something for me some people argue that BCAAs are pointless but it Mentally, I guess it helps me, if nothing else. And uh, so if I see a benefit from it, I'm going to take it. Um, I also take pre-workout. Uh, there's no in particular kind. I just don't go above 325 milligrams of caffeine in any of my pre-workouts. And I don't go above 2 grams of beta alanine in any of my pre-workouts. And sometimes I don't even take pre-workout. But if I do, I mix it with my carbo gain and my BCAAs just because I don't like drinking a bunch of shakes all day. Um, and this is all about, I drink my carbo game and BCA is about two hours to an hour and a half before. And then if I mix my pre-workout, then I'll actually drink all that about 35 to 40 minutes before my um, workout. Uh, I take creatine. When I get to my last two exercises uh, in the gym, I actually mix my creatine right in the gym. That's just my personal preference. I've always done it like that, and so I'm not gonna break my pattern. Uh, but there's only like a 2% difference in, no, a 0.02% difference, my fault, in taking creatine before your workout and taking creatine after as far as gains, and that's over an eight-week period. Uh, but I studied that in Maryland, so there's not a big, big difference. It doesn't matter when you take your creatine. Uh, five grams is what I take of creatine. Um, and then I take a multivitamin every day. I don't like pills, so I take the gummy version. But other than that, that's my whole stat, guys. I hope you find it useful. Um, and... Uh, don't base your stuff off mine because I'm going for I might be going for a different goal than you. But if your goals are the same as mine, then yeah, you could probably do the same stack and you would get a pretty good result out of it. Oh, and I, oh, of course, protein. But protein again, I've done a video on before. That's just a convenient supplement. Um, I don't take protein every day. Appreciate it, guys.